the ocean floor is quickly becoming the new frontier in geopolitical competition. Beneath the waves lies a hidden landmass known as the Continental Shelf, rich in vital resources like oil, gas, and rare earth minerals. This submerged territory extends far beyond visible coastlines and holds the key to energy, technology, and even internet infrastructure. As nations race to control these resources, the stakes have never been higher. At the heart of this scramble is the United Nations Commission on the Limits of the Continental Shelf, CLCS. Under the framework of the United Nations Convention on the Law of the Sea, UNCLOS, coastal countries can submit scientific ideas and technical data to extend their sovereign rights over the continental shelf beyond the standard 200 nautical miles. However, the window for submitting claims is narrowing, and countries are under pressure to act fast. Major players like Russia, China, and Canada have already made aggressive moves, deploying submarines and collecting seabed data to bolster their claims. The Arctic, for example, has become a focal point of contention with overlapping claims and strategic posturing intensifying global tensions. Meanwhile, technological advancements are making once inaccessible parts of the seafloor exploitable, further raising the stakes. This modern day land rush isn't just about fossil fuels. The ocean floor contains rare earth elements essential for electric vehicles, wind turbines, and advanced electronics. Additionally, undersea cables that form the backbone of the global internet run along these same shelves. Control over these underwater zones means influence over global communications and commerce. As the race for the continental shelf heats up, the implications for international politics are profound. Control over vast undersea territories could shift global power balances, making this one of the most critical and underreported geopolitical stories of our time. The ocean floor is no longer the final frontier. It's the next battlefield for global influence.